Hello, this is Taylor with Woolridge Plumbing here at 1012 Diamond Avenue. Um, making dirt movie here in the laundry room. Um, came here to do a sewer clean and we are going to also be doing a root X after the clean. Um, so at 103 feet we are at the city. We'll start pulling back. Um, we do still have that root right there where the city and our lateral meet. Um, did not run a machine this far. Um, ran a machine where the more critical areas were. Don't see any major issues this far. But again, our shop does look at the, these videos again. And in case I miss something, bring it up. <clears throat> this is a clay line. Some scale right here, so I ran a lot of water trying to push these the scale out. But as we pull back, you'll see chunks like that filled up a lawn, the lawn, the washer, and dumped that. Still got that room right there. But. So, as you can tell, my machine went about this far, 65 feet, and our big blockage was at this joint right here, 64. Um, this is where I was like about almost 100% blockage right here. But as you can tell, as we pull back, got a good clean on it. And then again, Rudex, once you put that on that, and kill, and kill it. There's another joint that was pretty bad that got cleaned up pretty good right there. And then Just tell you can see that scale on the bottom. It does get pretty heavy. But again, I did run quite a bit of water to push it out. Alright, so about 32 feet from where I'm at. Um, this is where we transition. Now we're going to be pulling back into cast iron. And this is the portion that we did do a D scale on, all the way back to where we access this line. So on this line is where we had heavy scale build up but as we broke it down. It's just, and this is coming back towards the floor draining that we did access it from. Yeah, did pretty good try pushing the scale out of there, but further down the line it just was pretty hard. But you know we did run a lot of water, so here's that access. There's a bathroom right here and then Laundry and dryer. Thank you for watching.